In this video, we're going to be talking about how they're trying to resurrect Ghostbur, and whilst doing so, they accidentally merged him with Jay Schlatt. Now, before we get into everything, please check that you are subscribed. With that all said, enjoy the video. Eric Filzer and Ranbu all meet up with Ghostbur to discuss the ways in which they'll resurrect him. Eric has been researching methods, and the one that might work is the one which requires them to build a shrine at the place that Wilbur was killed, and then for them to kill Ghostbur in the exact same way. Just to boost your memory a bit, Wilbur was killed by Phil just after he had pressed the button to blow up Lemanberg. Phil, the reason you're here is because you were the one who who killed Wilbur. And I found the place that you did it, which is now a crater. But I've I've built a small shrine, and I believe if if we carry out the ceremony yeah. on this shrine we stand a chance at maybe bringing him back. Now, Ghostbird doesn't really remember much from his past life as Wilbur, but the things he does remember is everything that happened in the room when he died. He remembers everything he said before pressing the button, the button actually being pressed and Lemanberg exploding, and when Phil killed him. So he goes up to the shrine and recites the words that he had said just before his death. Every time I try, I go into the button room and I, I try my best and I don't succeed. I get what I want, but not what I need. It's Coldplay. And I, I, <laughs> I'm just stuck in reverse. There's one thing that a traitor said. Eric, oh, that's you. You're the traitor. There's a thing that a tra traitor said once. Phil, it was, it was not meant to ever happen. Wait, no, it was never meant to no, be. No, no. Kill, kills her, kills her, kill me, kills her, please! Kills her! Uh... Phil, what have you done? Now, after the first attempt, it doesn't seem to work, and Ghostbird just disappears for a bit. But he comes back after a while, and something really does seem up. He tells everyone that when he died, everything went black, and he saw two people. He didn't have enough time to actually distinguish who the people were, he just knows there was two of them. Now, a question you may be asking is, who were they? Well, really, there can only be a few answers. What Ghostbus saw was basically death and the place that everyone goes to once they've lost their canon lives. Meaning, the two people there are just fully dead. Which tells us that it can either be Mexican Dream and Jay Schlatt, which I just don't think is going to be happening, or it can be Jay Schlatt and Wilbur. Ghostbird doesn't act the same as Wilbur or anything, so maybe he saw himself in his original form. And for Ghostbird to resurrect back into Wilbur, maybe he has to reach out to him. I died. I, that was canon. That was a canon death. That uh, was. Where did, where did you go? Like. I felt the sword go in my back. I felt. I felt. I felt. I felt free. I felt free. I felt like I'd done it. I felt like I broke free, and I and then I and I went. I went. I went somewhere dark, and there were two people there, and then and then and then I'm instantly back. Who were the two people? I'm, in, two, two I'm people? instantly and I'm instantly back. I'm here, and now I'm Ghostbur. Now, obviously, Eric's method isn't really working, so Phil goes into more depth about his way of resurrecting people and says that when you use a totem of undying, you see, like, the green splash that comes out of it. That splash area is actually energy that brings you back to life. So when you use a totem, you die, and then the energy revives you. This meaning to fully revive Wilbur, they'd have to kill him and everything the same way they just did, but this time he needs to be holding a totem. The one problem is, totems are the rarest things you can get, and can only be gained by going to a woodland mansion and killing some of the people inside of it. Now Ghostbird really wants to be resurrected right there and then, so he says that they need to go find Friend, which is his blue sheep, and then retry Eric's method a final time in the hopes that it works. But this time, when he does it, there seems to be some consequences which come with it. Wait, did it? Wait, 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 the fuck is this? I was Schlatt? Oh my god, I was whoa. jerking off. What the fuck is going? Where am I? Whoa, whoa, whoa! Oh god, whoa. what is this? Um, the fuck is wait this? a minute! Wait, 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 no, wait, wait! No, 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 no! Fuck this! Fuck! I don't want to come back to this goddamn what? server. What? <laughs> no, 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 no! You guys don't understand. I'm, I'm canonically dead. That's what I want. Nah, dude. What? Nah, dude. It's it's not it's not gonna happen. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I gotta go. I was in the middle of something. I mean, 
Oh, Wilbur! Oh, hello? Well? Yeah, by doing this, it seems like instead of reviving Wilbur, they sort of revived Schlatz. What's happened, I assume, is that when Ghostbird dies, he goes to the dark place with the two people, and he is meant to reach out to one of them, that then bringing them back to life. And instead of reaching out to normal, alive Wilbur, he reached out to Jay Schlatt, which has actually merged them together. So now Ghostbird is part Wilbur, part Jay Schlatt. Now one thing I wanted to mention is that I actually kind of predicted this. If you go into name MC and search at Wilbur Sir, you can see some of the Minecraft skins he has used in the past. And one of them was Ghostbird, but with ram horns. Now these horns are kind of associated with Jay Schlatt with his logo and his brand. And they actually tweeted out saying that they are probably going to revive Wilbur and accidentally merge him with Schlatt. And look what happened. Now because of this, you need to follow me on Twitter at KingKSG. <laughs> Why do I want a cigarette? And Just whiskey. Move. And whiskey. No whiskey. And no protein whiskey. powder. No. No. <laughs> the person who has the totems of undying at the moment. Did somebody say protein powder? <laughs> <laughs> oh, hello? Wait, where what is... was... Wait, are there souls oh, no. like Sorry, slightly I I merging out for or something? A what were you talking about with the outpost? I blacked out. Now, Phil, Eric, Rambo, and Turbo had actually gone looking for a woodland mansion and have retrieved a few totems of undying, but they haven't yet done the experiment on Wilbur. So you can probably expect that to happen in the upcoming days. But my theory is that for every day they maybe don't do the experiment, Wilbur will become more like Jay Schlatt, leading him to growing the ram horns that you saw in that skin and slowly and slowly turn more into Schlatt rather than Wilbur. But that's just my thoughts. Make sure you are subscribed and I'll see you in the next video, which is actually on screen. Go watch it now.